Google slide, you're going to learn more about Earth Day and what you can do to help the Earth. You'll notice my picture on the left. I, st I started cleaning up when I'm out on my exercise every day. And then I'm trying to encourage others to join the Clean Up Bedford movement with picking up one bag of garbage every time they're out. I want you to read this article by one of the junior CBC reporters. It's called, It's Time to Think About Reducing Along with Recycling. There's a video on the top and at the bottom, it takes you to a link with an article that I'd like you to read. The world of plastics. Since the 1950s, plastics have grown to be one of the most common materials of the world. They have received increased scrutiny in recent years due to their environmental impact while being recognized for their help in shaping a modern world. There's a video here to watch and it's actually set in Halifax Harbour showing all the plastic that is found in our harbour. Most of us use plastic every day. Toys, food containers, and toothbrushes are just some of the things that we use that are made out of plastic. Plastic is important, but it's also creating a huge problem in the environment, specifically in our oceans. The world produces a lot of plastic. In 2015, around 322 million tons of plastic were produced worldwide. And that's why our government is working hard to eliminate single-use plastics like plastic forks, plastic shopping bags, plastic wrappers on food. Please listen to this book by Todd Parr. It's called The Earth Book, and Todd Parr is one of my favorite children's authors, right under Robert Munch. I hope you enjoy his story as much as I do. Now it's time for you to start writing. I hope you've thought about three ways that you can help our Earth. Maybe you're going to go and pick up some garbage in your neighborhood. Maybe you're going to start reusing a plastic container that you normally throw out, or maybe instead of using plastic water bottles, you're gonna drink from a regular water bottle. Maybe your family has already started making some changes since COVID-19. I know my family is buying a lot less packaged food and we're doing a lot more home cooking and we hope to continue that even after we go back to our regular routine. So maybe you'll start walking to school instead of getting a drive. Think about three things that you can do to help our earth. Not just the things that you could do, but things that you will commit to doing to making our earth a better place and a healthier place for us to live. And don't forget to use the editing checklist when you're done before you turn in this assignment.